Welcome everyone to Planet Papas. Today we're back on Shuang Beach having a walk down. Finally going to go the other way. There is some shoreline for us to walk down so I finally get to go on the other side to show you the different hotels, the different part of the beach and it seems pretty calm today. So let's go. So if you remember last time or every time we only get to the Elephant Beach Club and from there it's impossible to actually keep walking. So today we're obviously going that way. And here is the Elephant Beach Castle. Before it went up to the third step and I almost killed myself but that was another day. We're still here. So the elephant does have some floating oh, like lilos but interesting. Yesterday a viewer told me that the waves are pretty crazy here in the afternoon but today no problem. So let's go have a look at this place. Inside the elephant we found a new place and it's called Loved. And Loved is very busy. It must be a cheaper accommodation because there's a lot of people here and it's packed. So we're gonna have a look at it and I'll show the prices as well while we're going through it. <laughs> so this is the front area of Loved. So they do promote a lot of parties and stuff like that so you know it's for the younger crowd. But there's a lot of older people here as well for the accommodations. So they do a Samui pub crawl, which we might look at that as well, every Thursday from 6.30 and every Wednesday they have loco bingo. Interesting. And pool parties. There is a full moon party on February 4th, but then they got smart and said the warm-up party is on the 3rd. So there's a few DJs on Friday the 3rd with buckets, show, entertainment, good stuff. So now we're going to go through the main part. So I've never seen this place ever before as well. So we're going together to see it. And I should be able to get you prices right now. And because the blinds are open, they are cleaning the room so I can show you the room. So they are smaller, single beds, kitchen and things. So they're basic studios, but what else do you need? Okay, now we're gonna head to their pool area and beachfront. It's very colorful. Old school mask. I said to do a lot of posting here. So they tell you what's going on every day, what's going on in the social part of Samui. We'll head down to reception. So they come. <laughs> Very good, thank you. So they come. So they do have everything that you need here adventures, side trips, bikes, elephant trips, pig island. Pretty good. So it does remind me of a backpacker's bar, but a little more cleaner. <laughs> the word I was looking for is cleaner. <laughs> Oh, they even got a mascot. Hey, who's your cat? Where's your tail? Huh? What are you doing? You got some bling bling on. So we're going up. They do have ping pong in the pool area as well. And a big massive swing. Nice. So it is a small pool area, but still busy as. Eatery, restaurants, nice the beach, enjoy the waves. Nice pool bar. Now to the front of the pool area where it has a pool right on the beach. Okay, so that was an interesting place. There's a lot of young ones there, which is cool. And we're going to continue on. It's so right beside there. They're actually doing a lot of construction here. And there's no name yet or anything. It looks all brand new. This is so exciting. I get to walk down here, which I haven't done forever. I've been here before. It's the Lucky Mother. Nice place just to have a drink on the beachfront. Very old school.
And as you can see, the tide really ripped up the shore. Not so great. Okay, now I'm in the Montine Hotel. This is the pool area. The accommodations are the same where they're more of the old school Thai on the beach. You see in most of my videos anyways. So the tide ripped up this place so badly. I had to make steps out of sandbags and different things. You can see all the rocks. But I think the worst is over. It's a big full moon party on Saturday, so that's gonna solve everybody's problem. Okay, we did come to the opening of this place and it's called Combo. Let's have a look to see how it's going. If you come to Samui, Combo is a great place for you to just enjoy, relax. It does have a beach bar, front, same idea, where you don't have to be a part of the hotel. You just come through, DJ's above, three little pools hanging around, enjoying a beautiful day in Shuang Beach. Nice music, shade everywhere. Really cool place. Been here a few times, really like it. Just really relaxing. And this is Combo. Okay. Now we're going to go through the Shuang Regent. Now we're in the Shuang Regent Hotel. These are the bungalows on the beachfront. It's actually a very nice place. Here's the pool area with the little spa bubbles. It's a big pool shaped in a big peanut, I think. A four leaf clover, I'm not sure. <laughs> looks very nice. Came around the other side, didn't want to film kids or anything like that, so... Very nice place. So we just left the Shuang region, we're heading on the beach to the next hotel. Yeah, this side's more calm, very nice. That was still the region, there were bungalows right on the seafront here. And of course, massage on the beach. So if you're looking at this, these are not garbage. It's all sandbags just to hold back when the bad days come. <laughs> Next door to this, it needs quite a bit of work and I'm not sure if they're working on it or it's over. Yes, this one looks like you need a good six to eight million to fix it up. So if anybody has that in their pocket, now's your chance. And now we're gonna go through Dara. Now Dara has Thai cooking and it's for 1900 baht per person. Enjoy the day and making Thai traditional food. I've never actually been to this area, so this is interesting as well. There's some really nice beachfront bungalows here. I'm gonna go through Dara's kitchen, Dara's cafe. Now we'll go around it to the beachfront. It's a very beautiful pool. This is the front. 
front of the pool area. Finding a few surprises here. So this is Moonrise. Just a cool place to hang out by the beach. There's no pool area, but still. Very cool. This must be the stay, but I'm not sure what that says. If anybody knows, tell me in the link below. But it is the stay. Okay, now we're going to go through Reira. Reira is a very nice place. So we're going to go through it now. So this is the Mayang Samoy Resort. Rooms have their own balconies. Rare Spa. Let's go right toward the pool. Very nice pool area indeed. If the sun is shining on your head, you don't want to go that way. You can go through this way, through the caves. Now you're shaded and cool. And now back to the sun. Marang Sui, Marang Samui Resort. A nice beachfront restaurant. This side is much calmer. Now we're in front of OP Bungalow. KOP bungalow, a lot of chairs, but you don't see all oh, the buildings are in the back. Yep, nice. Okay, now we're in front of Marine Shang Resort. This side is very, very relaxing. And today we decided to stay by the Yacht Park. It's not crazy busy. I'm not sure what's going on this season. Hopefully the people will come back, but the Yacht Park is not as packed as it ever was. Which is weird. And that's all for today. So thank you for joining me here on Planet Papas. And we'll see you tomorrow. So don't forget to like, subscribe, ring that bell, tell all your friends, and see you soon. And if you like, I'll actually put a link down here so you can buy me a spring roll. Thank you and take care for now.